Friday night in Rio de Janeiro's posh neighborhood Leblon. Bars are packed and overflowing. By law, they should be operating at no more than two-thirds capacity. But not a mask is to be seen anywhere. No police and evidently no coronavirus concerns. Clearly business is booming in this part of the city. But there has been a heavy toll on the drinking and dining business in Rio de Janeiro. According to the city's Bar and Restaurant Association, 1,000 have already closed their doors permanently and another 3,000 are likely to shut down by the end of the year. But not Sushi das Artes. This tastefully lit, high-end restaurant opened in the middle of the pandemic with the idea of offering people a safe dining experience in well-ventilated outdoor cabins with minimal contact between clients and servers. A phone app is used for everything, from reservations to ordering and payment. Felipe Palermo, one of Sushida's Artish founders, lost his job as an events promoter. He says he was inspired by a Dutch restaurant he saw online and decided to see if he could apply the model in Rio. We have 34 cabins and are open from Tuesday to Sunday and it has been full every day. Our waiting list is so long, we have reservations for December and even for January. So it turned out to be an idea people love. This is the first time Ana Paula Caldas and her husband have ventured out to eat since March. For them, safety was a priority, but they also found a romantic setting. So we are here, having dinner, which was delicious. The atmosphere is lovely and the music is great. The place is beautiful. We are relaxed because we are by ourselves in a small cabin. It is great. Food is also prepared in the well-ventilated outdoors, with masked chefs respecting distance guidelines. The restaurant has clearly tapped into a niche of Brazilians who remain concerned about the pandemic while so many others appear to have dropped their guard. I think there is still a lot of risk and people are not believing we are experiencing a pandemic. They are exposing themselves. While there has been a drop in both daily reported cases and fatalities in Brazil since August, experts say the pandemic is far from over and a new surge may be on the horizon. Still, in this restaurant, an oasis in the middle of the chaos, some have found a little bit of normality, a cause for celebration. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN, Rio de Janeiro.